I've already imported the video into the timeline so the next thing is to go to effects and then from there I go to video effects now the one I want to go to in video effects is color correction RGB curves I drag it and I put it on the video from there I go into effects control I'm gonna actually just be touching up the red and blue I bring down the blue just slightly as you can tell it's already changed on the right I'm not gonna touch the green like I said and now the blue I put it up it's a very simple uh, correction on the Q500's camera um, and you, actually you're done right there but see there it is the effect now I'm going to want to change the brightness and contrast I'm going to select it where is it right there oh, that's about it. right there I drag it and now I'm going to bring down the brightness just a tiny bit to about 6.7 bring the contrast up to 7.4 it will vary and then I go into sharpness I'm gonna sharpen up just a little bit not too much I'm gonna bring it up let's see how much maybe to 11 it's not bad and then we're done the final result right there um, should be fairly easy see? I'm gonna take them off just to see the before and after watch before now after Now I'm going to export it. I'm going to go to export media, go into H.264. Oh, I'm going to change a few things. I'm going to go down to the uh, bitrate encoding to two pass, change this up to bitrate target to 35, and that's it. From there, you export it, and you have a perfectly good video without the yellowish yellowish tint. Hope you guys enjoy it.